Hey folks, how y'all doing today? I'm just showing you what this all uh, this this thing will do right here. This uh Mate 3, Outback Mate 3. And we got our front moving through today. But I'm gonna just show you a little bit what it will do. Alright. Graph. Okay, today is was, was a fairly windy day. And I wonder if y'all can see that or not. I'll try to zoom in a hair. Let's see here. And then we just seen it seeing a state of charge. It's hundred percent. And in today we've we put in two hundred five thousand seven hundred and sixty watts or five thousand seven hundred and sixty kilowatt hours today we brought in at two hundred and eighteen fifteen amp hours. Alright, let's go to next we we'll go to shunts. I got shunts A for solar and B for my wind on my wind. Okay, let's go to shunt B A for it. For today, we have our max is sixty-three point one amps at one thousand seven hundred twenty watts uh, that we bought in today. That's our, our peak. Next. Shunt B, today we bought in 14.4 amps for wind, 390 watts over here for wind wind today. And I think our top gust today, let me, oh, let me look on my, my Davis. Okay, now we're making some power. Uh, back, right now we're bringing in 2.8 amps, 3.4. 8 amps, 1 point, and it, the wind is, see it, 1.2 amps, 2.7 amps, it's bringing in, and it's all data logging, all that, and graphing everything for me, and you see it, see the configurations moving back and forth, that is so cool, alright, alright, and let's see here, jump B, um, let's go back. Okay. Okay, we'll go to graph. That's the battery. What it's doing right now. This is the FNDC. This is showing me all the stuff on the Outback Mate 3. State of charge, 100%. That's over a 24-hour period. That's shunt A. Uh, that's showing the history of what kind of power we've been putting out today. Um, through the power output, right now we're putting out 130 watts of solar. You can see on the top left hand corner, 130 watts. And next is shunt B, and that's the wind. That's the wind. And that, in the, in the top left hand corner, it's a zero watts. Uh, when it starts producing power, it'll show you the power. But that's the kind of wind we have on the graph today. And that's just giving you a rough estimate of what kind of power been, we've been putting out today. But I will see right there, it's 50 watts, 30 watts. And that's what kind of wind is it's putting out. I just showed you, I just, on the top hand, left hand corner, I just showed you the wind output. And this is what I've been looking for for a long time. Something, there you go. Something, something to show you kind of what kind of wind power this thing will, will, will it will operate off of shunts. And to operate good, to get good power measurements, you need to measure off your shunts. Like your trimetrics, your Bogart engineering trimetric will show you. Uh, all that kind of stuff. This, this will graph it for me and show me what I got. Without having to use a computer, I mean, I, I can take my SD card out and do the same thing, uh, and and put on an Excel sheet, and it'll do that for me. But I can be sitting inside the house and show, see, with my Ethernet, show you what kind of power I'm putting out, or, or through my um, computer, that is through my Netgear I got out here set up. But yeah, I think that is pretty neat. 
but yeah I'm sorry, sorry about the clarity of this but anyway I just want to give you a little update of what's going on and uh that's my phone sorry about that uh yeah that's pretty neat all right well anyway well backlight just went out um back graph but anyway next anyway i just want to give you a little update of what's going on with the system and it is going cool but anyway this is kvsmc or virality and i want to thank you for watching my videos and give, just give me a little update and the mate three if you ever have any problems with it, um, tech support will be there 24-7 for you. Uh, I don't know about 24-7, but you know, I mean, they're, I mean the op actual operating hours. But if you ever have any problems with the Mate 3, they will, they will help you out um, in e every way possible. Uh, let me see here. Okay, let me get this screen up right here. But anyway, I'm going to show you a little bit show you a little bit about my system but uh my other little mate 3 had a little issue uh nothing major but it's anything to do with electronics um anything man-made or robot or uh mechanically made robots etc is subject to failure which is hey that's going to happen in the computer world today but they are right on top of things. I called them up. They sent me a new unit out. No problems. Uh, but anyway, and, and I, everything was saved in my SD card. So all my, everything that I had saved previously was saved through my SD card. So just, you get, they sent me a new unit. I, I flipped in my SD card. I had some questions to call uh, tech support and they, they helped me through it. So uh, overall, it's a great system. No problems. Tech support is awesome. And just want to let y'all know I'm very pleased. Thank you for watching. And this is an update on my Mate 3. And once we get some more wind readings and solar readings, I will let you know what was go what's going on with everything. And the FNDC or the, the FlexNet DC is awesome. Good to go. All right. Thanks for watching. This is. Uh, hold up. I'm sorry. But this is my system. I have. Uh, 2,310 watts of solar and with Kyocera solar and a high energy some old style 24 volt wind turbine at 24 volts 1,000 watt at 24 volts this is my Davis Vantage view and there is my new style of high energy with the new new style blades, it's a that's a 1,000 water at 24 volts. But that is my system. Everything is running up apart. I love that Outback Mate 3. All right, y'all. This is KVUSMC. I want to thank y'all for watching, and please subscribe. Uh, any comment, please leave any comments you need, want. And Outback Power. Tech support. Thank y'all so much, and thank you again, Outback Power. All right, y'all have a great one. All right, bye bye.